For the past 13 years, the ball for the Brawl AU basketball tournament has been held in Grand Rapids. It was a tough call, and it was something that we waited as long as we possibly could. Unfortunately, due to the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, the Grand Rapids Storm, in partnership with the Indy Heat and Gym Rats, have chosen to move the tournament to Fort Wayne, Indiana. The state of Michigan right now, they're they're not even operating gyms. Gyms, gyms currently aren't open, so that that's the number one factor. Um, we had hoped July 4th we were going to get into the next phase where gyms would be open and we were kind of hopeful that we would slowly be emerging into small group capacities. The tournament had a record 242 teams last year, all ranging from fourth grade to 17U. And with so many families coming into Grand Rapids, it was a huge boost for the local economy. Economic impact is basically 1.5 million is what, what we're coming up with as far as numbers go. Probably about a million as far as hotel and entertainment. Despite the current situation with the pandemic, more than 260 teams were hoping to attend this weekend. But organizers are now capping the tournament at 200 teams for everyone's safety. Allows for you know enough time in between games to get fans in and out of the gym. Allows us the uh, proper social distancing and the use of courts, which is our number one thing too. We don't want to max out the number of courts in a facility. So Jarvis and Jimmy can Jason Martin is the director of the Grand Rapids Storm and has been organizing the tournament since it started in 2007. He says they will be doing all they can to make sure everyone stays safe all weekend long. We're going to roll out all the stops. We're you know, limited the number of people that are going to be in a gym. Um, we're going to be under Indiana's guidelines, which are 250 at one time. All spectators, everybody in the building, minus the players, officials, and coaches will be wearing masks. Go through the COVID questionnaire with everybody that's walking in the building. Um, our officials are going to be tested. It may not be happening here in West Michigan, but Martin is excited that the tournament can still go on. The talent level out there is going to be unbelievable. Unbelievable. The number of Big Ten players or commits or recruits that will be playing will be great. Um, so I think it'll be really good for us and for the kids. But, no, it's going to be a little bit different. Games will begin Thursday night in Fort Wayne with the top 17 U teams starting it off. Zach Herrick, Fox 17 News.